Ladies and gentlemen, today we are playing Risk of Rain 2, but we can only pick up items you could find in real life. And of course, in Trento Mento fashion, all of the items will be multiplied by 10. We are rocking with multi today because I can see multi in real life. A little robot dude just hanging around being a little friend. Why not? And if multi is your favorite survivor, let me know down in the comments. I want to know how many people in my community are fans of my little robot friend. You can see right here, crowbar. Very much a real life item. <laughs> you can find crowbars in real life pretty frequently. And so that's what I mean. Mochas, available in this run. Uh, focus crystals, no, not available in this run. 57 leaf clover, no, not here. And let me see what we get first. Ooh, lens maker's glasses for 100% crit. Now look, uh, some of these items are a little bit on the edge, right? Lens maker's glasses, what is that really? I, I don't know. I do know that sunglasses exist in real life, so I, you know, I let it slide. We get more crit glasses, awesome, and a foreign fruit. Um, now foreign fruit, I guess you couldn't find in real life, but you can find fruit in real life, and there really weren't many equipments that you can find in real life other than like executive card, so I added it in there. Also, we now have 20 crit, and I think how the stacking mod works now. If I print into a printer, I think I'm going to get 10 of these and it's going to take away 10. Oh, that is perfect. Now we got 10 crowbars and still that 10 crit. Another chest, another 10 items. Energy drink. Very good. Also, uh, none of the void items you can find in real life. Name me one. So there will be no void items this run. Because they're all like magical alien items and that doesn't exist on Earth. Let's see what we get for our healing item. But yeah, okay. Yep, I mean, I, I understandable. I, I understand why that showed up. There aren't a lot of healing items that exist in real life. So we're gonna have to take the stake. Another item is, ooh, I'm gonna grab it. Red Whip is gonna be fast. <laughs> it's gonna be very fast. Okay, our speed is gonna start to move really quickly. Obviously, you can find Red Whips in the real world. You just take a whip and you buy a red one. Uh, I am gonna have to watch out for speed because Mocha and Goat Hoofs also both exist in the real world. And we want to be able to control our speed if possible because we will die to fall damage if we are not careful. Let's hit teleporter because I think we're already done. Uh, what do we got? Wandering Vagrant and... Ooh, that doesn't do a lot after that crowbar. Probably should have went with my, my rail gun there. But decent damage nonetheless. Cool, it is down. Our item is a guillotine. Old guillotine. That actually makes more sense. The only guillotines you would find today would probably be pretty old. Here we are in the bazaar. I don't think I'm going to take any of these. This will take 30 items from me, I'm pretty sure. And Ben's raincoat. I mean, I have a friend named Ben, and I would assume he has a raincoat. So both of these definitely exist in real life. Let's head on over to Abandoned Aqueduct. However, Jaros and Ronald's bands don't exist in real life, so we will not be getting those. Oh my gosh, we got a yellow printer on stage two. We're at eight minutes. <laughs> None of the yellow items exist either in real life, at least that I know of. So uh, we don't have any yellow items available, even if we got one for stage TP. But that's really interesting. We are given rusted keys, which is pretty interesting. Um, we'll just have a key every stage, which is wonderful. And a roll of pennies. Now we can start to get the money up. Hey, Wisp, just want to hit me one time real quick. Want to hit me one time. Thanks so much. That's 270 gold. Yes, I also took the creative liberty to say that, uh, war banners exist in real life. Maybe they don't give you extra power, but, uh, fungus? A little mushroom that exists as well. Also, a fun fact for everyone I did not know. Tri-tip dagger? Totally a thing in real life. Look it up. It is horrifying <laughs> but it's totally a real thing and i'm gonna take a harvester scythe because one i have that crit and also i'm scared of the speed speaking of tri-tip let me grab one of those just for fun and now we have a bunch of bleed going on mocha and gasoline our attack speed is faster now and our movement speed is way faster and that gasoline is gonna feel oh so good and tougher times teddy you can get teddy bears in walmart wherever you want really so we are grabbing one of those i may have accidentally gone a little high let's head over to teleporter and uh, get that going let me just use my bungus real quick hit this we do have a foreign fruit as well if we really need to but i don't think we will let me just Boop. Oh, that is a ton of damage. Let's get the gasoline going and just start hitting him. 
Let's just start going. Yeah, that'll work. Got a Warhorn, also a totally real thing, and so we're grabbing 10 of them. Stage 3 begins with a Void Seed, which isn't really what I wanted to see. Okay, I'm gonna give it to you straight here. Not what I was looking for. However, it is clear. <laughs> we just can't get any Void items, so, uh... I'll look for a Void Potential, but that'll be about it. Got our Lockbox and an ATG Missile. Now, I'll be honest. Did I look up if that exact thing exists? Not, not, re not really. Not, not really. No, not exactly. Uh, but Missiles exist, and I can only assume it's based off of a real one. More Tougher Times Teddy and a Fuel Cell. Well, ten of them. Uh, fuel cells, I mean, you, you could use for something in some kind of machine, I would imagine. So we're taking that in a backup magazine. Definitely exists. So that is now going to be a lot of fun. And armor piercing rounds. Our damage to a boss is going to be great. Let's grab a card, you know? Let's grab one of those. Uh, ooh. Do we want to go Goat Hoof? Um, uh, I don't know. Sticky Bombs, uh, they exist in real life to some extent. They don't look like, they don't look like that, I would imagine. But, um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab the Goat Hoof. And maybe I'm gonna regret it. We'll keep the crit for scrap later if we need it. But now, uh, we sprint pretty fast. More gasoline and more mocha. Things are getting a little bit precarious. We can scrap if we need to. You know what? I am gonna scrap a little bit. I'm gonna scrap the red lips and maybe the energy drinks. Yeah, okay, this movement speed, much more manageable. But I will grab another 10 fuel cells. We certainly don't need it for our executive card, but I would imagine we're gonna find more equipments as we go. Let's grab this and do teleporter. It is more Ben's raincoat. Okay, we saw it in the bazaar and now it gave it to us. Cool, thank you, Ben. Let's start up teleporter clay dune strider. Boop. Oh, the, oh, I lost the crowbar damage. That's okay. Uh, we do shred through regardless, and we're given a bandolier, which I also had to look up. That is just its name. That's a real thing. I didn't know that was a real thing, but it, it's exactly what it is. It's like an ammo belt, which is kind of cool. Here we are on Sundered Grove. I'm just trying to get hit by some enemies here. Uh, they're going for the drones, and the drones are actually dealing with them. I just want cash. We don't have a lot to open chests. We will open this and grow. Okay. Okay, I don't know if I don't know if we need the speed. Hello, sir. Watch how fast we go through this. Look at the bleed. Look at the fire rate. Oh my goodness. I am going to avoid the red whip for now. I don't want to be moving that fast. I just don't know if that is going to be helpful to us. We will grab what is that? Our fortieth tougher time steady. So our roll of pennies starting to get relatively useless. Uh, we'll move up. We got a war banner and we got our delicate watch. Uh, that I was excited for. Our damage just took a massive jump and we're gonna be one-shotting almost everything from here on out. Med kit, also kind of a real thing. Doesn't really just heal you that easily, but it does exist. Oh, we get shurikens. 10 shurikens goes so hard. Uh, that's gonna be really, really nice. I've just been going around hitting combat shrines whenever I can, and then just going beep, and beep, and he's dead already. Okay, cool, we'll loop. The last step before, oops, last step before teleporter is a red, and we get, I mean, you can find spare drone parts anywhere, really, a scrapyard, uh, any sort of stole. I mean, look, it's a good item. Okay, well, what can I say? I wanted it, and I totally, it's totally a real item. Teleporter begins. I'm hoping to one-shot. I don't know if we will. Let's try. Boop. We do. Oh, we do. And more guillotines. I mean, this isn't really going to be that helpful. We already kind of one-shot everything, but I mean, it's fun. Well, stage four was extremely easy, as I suspected. And so stage five should be just as easy. I saw a gup, but I don't think I can reach him. He's hidden Z construct. <laughs> Goodbye. I mean, yeah. Yep. Yeah, that's what we want to see. Just farming up some good old gold. The teddies do a good job, but they don't block everything. Some things get by, and our gold is moving up quickly. The decision to pick up the Red Bull or not. I'm going to do it. I don't think we're at too bad of speed yet. It's really not the end of the world. Crowbar, easy choice. Teddies, even easier. A stun grenade is our first one of the run. Easy item to add, and gasoline as well for 40. Another scrapper is here, which means two things. One, thank goodness we can get rid of that. And then I also think we can get rid of these. <laughs> we don't really need them. 
Uh, crit glasses, we don't need 30 of them, uh, so I'm gonna get rid of that many. And Red Whip is also getting a toodaloo from me. Now, you know what we haven't found yet and may not find at all, which I'm very sad about, is fireworks. We didn't find a single firework this whole run. And that's, like, one of the easiest items to put on this list and uh, one of my favorite items in the game. And it just isn't here. Also, there was not a single equipment anywhere on this stage. So any ch- Wow, that did a lot. Uh, any chance of a pillar skip is- is no longer. Uh, something tells me pillars is not gonna be the end of the world. So let's just do TP and get on out of here. Teleporter begins with goodbye and we get a fuel cell for our troubles for the equipment that we don't have. Thank you so much for absolutely nothing. In a last ditch effort, try to get fireworks. We're getting rid of the Ben's raincoat because, uh, we, we, I mean, we don't need it. And we're gonna hope for a firework printer on the moon. Now I have two questions for you. One, can we pillar skip? And I'll show you why I'm asking. And two, are we gonna one-shot Mithrix? That's kind of the question here. We do have 40 crowbars. Um, I think there's a chance. Uh, let me see if we can pillar skip. Can we get up there? Oh, I don't think we can quite do it. We're so close. We find a mocha printer at Soup's here. We definitely can, but if we do not, then I think we are out of luck. Hmm, I don't love this for me, actually. Not a huge fan. Oh my, and the teddies are really, they're gonna fall through right there. I got 50 of them, and I fell once. Okay, we're given shurikens, warhorn, tesla coil. We're given Ben's raincoat. Interesting. Anything around this little corner? No, let's check up top. Oh, there are ATGs up here. Let's grab three of these because it's ATGs. And we'll grab a Tesla coil just for fun. I'm realizing now, maybe an issue. Uh, we don't have a phase four skip of any kind and that does not bode well. No white printers here at all. Very sad. I'm so sorry, Ben's Renko. Okay, did I fall again? Yeah, absolutely. Are the teddies gonna block it? Yup. Hey, there it is. And look at the teddies now. You know, it's gonna, I'm gonna take fall damage but get blocked like this. These things disgrace us. Multi shooting like this is so satisfying. Just the like, Pure raw damage is impeccable. Ladies and gentlemen, it is that time. I do still have, what, nine keys? Where are my keys at? Do I have keys in my inventory? Oh, interesting. When you use one key, it uses all ten. There's no more key in my inventory. I was going to say, I didn't see the lockbox down there. I was looking, but I did not see it. But without further ado, let's get in here. I know that you possibly can transport with multi into mythrix to skip phase four we are going to try it <laughs> do i oh my oh uh do i think it's gonna work no because i've never done it before and have no idea how it works but <laughs> i will give it a shot that is for sure uh let's go like this and wow no, that's almost everything dead immediately there we go completely clear mythrix comes back down Let's see if I do this. Oh, I missed him completely, I think. That's interesting. Okay, jump. Good, 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 good. Hold on. Land, and can we just do this or get in there or something? I don't know how it works. Hold on. I'm going to try to put my hitbox right in the middle. When he dies, no, it wasn't there. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Okay, this is bad. This is bad, everybody. This is not good. He has Tesla coil. I will die immediately, but I'm going to try my best. Here we go. All the possible damage. Go, 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 go. Everything, everything, everything. Oh my god, we got stuff back. We actually got stuff back. There's no way, right? Oh my god, his attack speed is so intense. No! <laughs> we got back so much stuff, but he's still at a hundred of some of the items. We were so close. We must have gotten killed by a shuriken or a sticky bomb because we had our crit, we had our crowbar, we had our bleed. But it was just not going to work out for us today. I hope y'all enjoyed the crazy video nonetheless. Let me know any items you think I missed other than fireworks. Because those just didn't appear, which is big lame. And with that being said, I will see y'all next time.